Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a folder that cannot be accessed or deleted by anybody except you. So the first thing we're going to do is open up our command prompt and we are going to locate the directory that our folder is in. In my case it's in the desktop, it's on the desktop. And if you don't know how to change your directory, you can watch my last video. I'll post it below. Um, it'll show you how to change your directories. So after you've located the directory that the folder is in, I've set up these instructions on the right hand side over here that you can follow. So we're going to type in CACLS space, then you're going to enter the folder name. In my case it's test space forward slash E space forward slash C space forward slash D space percent username percent and now you're going to hit enter and now it says that it processed the directory so now when we click on this folder it's going to say that we don't have permission to access this folder and if you try to get permission to access it and press continue it says you have been denied permission to access this folder and when you hit close it closes the folder so this means that we cannot get into the folder and if we right click and press delete and press yes it says you need permission to perform this action so we can't delete the folder either now in order to make it so we can access the folder and delete it again we're going to type in CACLS space then the folder name which is test in my case space slash e space slash c space slash g space percent username percent colon and then you're going to enter the disk letter in my case it's on the c drive so I'm going to type in c and press enter and now it says that it processed that directory again and now when we double click on the folder it opens up and you can view all of your folders inside. Alright guys, I hope you liked this video and if you did, be sure to comment, like, or subscribe. And if you missed my last two videos, one of them shows how to create a password for a file on your flash drive or external hard drive. And my other video shows how to crack a WinRAR password. So if you missed those two videos, be sure to check those out. And as always, have a great day.